Hey guys, it's me Chris. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So if you notice that the quality is a bit different, it's because I got a new phone. So the quality has improved and I will be sharing with you guys the things that I picked up during my quarantine intense buys. These are some of the things that I re-upped on that I've already owned and I just needed to just buy a new one and then i got some new glosses and some new shadows so i just wanted to come on here and share it with you guys so i got stuff from mac macy's beauty supply store as well as sephora so let's go ahead and let's jump right into the video so i went to the beauty supply store so i went in there to go and pick up some lashes and i got this one right here from inv 3D Collection 109. I also got Broadway 3D in number four. Broadway 3D in number three. I really, really, really like these. And then I saw that Cherry Blossom, which is like old school, you know, eyelashes for me. Um, they had the 3D versions now. I'm actually wearing this one as well on my eyes right now. The 907s and I just picked up another one, but this is what they look like. They're really pretty, right? Very, very, very pretty. And then I picked up the number 910, which I should have got like a couple more of these because this is really pretty too. From Mac, I made an online order and I bought a Pro Palette nine eyeshadow pan as well as the nine eyeshadow um insert the shadow that's currently in here right now i believe that this is sketch if i'm incorrect i will leave it um down below in the description bar so i picked up um nine eyeshadows this is the first one and then the next one that i picked up is called too too good which looks like this I also got Sable, Red Brick, Saddle, Cranberry. This one is Sketch. Rule. And this last one right here is Libra. This one was really pretty. I like it. I thought it was very pretty. You know, it's really like mauve and glittery and pinky. My bestie is a Libra and my daddy is a Libra too. So gang gang. Also from Mac, they sent me this makeup setting spray, like the mini um version of the Mac Prep and Prime Fix It. So a while back, I had bought the shade Raisin, which is this blush color right here, as well as I had buy this six um, insert right here. And you see it fit perfectly into the Pro Palettes. I got cleaned up a little bit, but that's all right. And it also come with like this clear glass, which I thought was pretty cool. Gives it a nice feature. And y'all ignore my nails, you know, it's quarantine time. From Macy's, I got the MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus Matte Spray. This is what it looks like. I picked up my favorite moisturizer. You guys know, I think I mentioned this in like a haul video as well last year. But you guys know that it's my favorite moisturizer. It's Clinique Moisture Surge. And I got the limited edition um, like flower packaging. This is what it looks like really 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 nice moisturizer i have oily skin um it's really good for people that have oily skin and for people that have dry skin as well highly highly recommend also from macy's i picked up this mac prep and prime highlighter i actually used it today underneath my eyes so works really well i like it um it provided the coverage that i needed this is what it looks like right here and i got this one in peach luster the last thing that I got from um, Macy's is this Cartier La Panthère Parfum. I really, really, really wanted this perfume. Last year, I had got a sample of this when I had went to Macy's. And I walked all around the store and it has smelled bomb. By the way, um, 
check out my perfume video i will list that in the description box i probably need to make like an updated one but yeah so basically in there i talked about tips and tricks about you know perfume and that was one of them where you basically like you know you spray yourself a bit with it and you walk around the mall and then you come back and if you if it's still on you and you like it then you purchase it and i just never got around to purchasing this one because it is so expensive this perfume was like over a hundred dollars i think it was like 124 or 125 if i'm not mistaken um i'll leave the price here on the screen i never really wanted like to spend that much on a perfume i mean i've spent like 60 70 80 dollars but you know this much for perfume i i thought it was a bit much but it smells really 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 good i'm talking like <sighs> the best way how to describe this perfume is the sexiest woman that just walk into the room and she, like all eyes on her um all noses turned in her direction like it's just bomb i mean it just smells like up here like them other ones smell good but she ain't come to play. She come to slay. This is like the shit. Excuse my language. This is really good. And it comes with like a little back like insert thing right here. And then you just take it out. And then you, you know, you press down on it. And it comes out through right here. And it has the panther like embedded inside of it. Oh, it just smells sensual sexy musky with a little hint of like floral but it smell like i don't know what else they have to it i probably have to like go look up the notes and it's smooth i owe it real nice go and check it out if i get a little coins for it definitely check it out right so from sephora I basically re-upped on my Becca Evermatte Poreless Priming Perfector. This is my favorite primer because I have oily skin. And this will like literally suck you in <laughs> um, on your face so like no oils will come through. That's what it looks like. And then y'all know how Sephora gives you like samples. So I got these samples right here. I think they from Way or something like that. Or We. I don't know how you really pronounce it. But these are the shampoo and the conditioner. And then this is from Guerlain. This is their Radiance Concentrate with Pure Gold Makeup Base. Just a little sample here on the back. And what I really wanted to get from Sephora was these Fenty Beauty by Rihanna, her gloss bombs. I have heard so much about these. I've seen these everywhere and this is my first time getting them. And I like, baby, I have one on now, like on my lips. I have on the Diamond Milk one and mm, so good like love at first sight while lip gloss like can you believe oh my gosh this one right here is diamond milk this is the packaging by the way this is what it looks like what the fuck about the pawn some more right now just a little bit y'all see this oh my god mm. and it smell mm. it smell good not like a like you know not too sweet of a candy, but like, it smells very candy-ish. And this, this, you know, the gloss is not like sticky, sticky. It's just like the right amount of sticky. And it just, oh, you just look at this, like, it just looks so good. Pick up yourself, Riri. So these glasses are bomb, bomb, bomb. I highly, highly, highly recommend them. The next one that I got is in Sweet Mouth. I'm excited for this one too. Oh my gosh, it looks so gorgeous. This is what it looks like right here. Mm, this one smells a bit more like bubble gum ish. It's really nice. And look at that. That shit is so pretty man i can't wait to try this one on too 
that's everything you guys that I picked up online during my online shopping um, I just wanted to try some things out and of course read up and I hope that you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much to you guys who send me DMs, you know, on my Facebook and on my Instagram, especially regarding my recipes and my cooking and stuff like that. I am so excited and it always makes me feel good, you know, to answer you guys' questions. And I appreciate you guys watching. And as always, thank you so much for liking the video, sharing, subscribing, um, comment down below. You know, I always respond back to my comments. Make sure that you guys stay safe, you know, COVID-19 still going around. Um, so yeah, just be safe and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye guys.